My name is Alban Montgomery and I was on the Bloodstock Performance Horse Management course. I feel really pleased and I feel very ready to move on now to the next thing. I really liked my lecturers. I think that we're working with great academics here and they're really here to support you and that was my favourite part of the course. My advice would be to have a good relationship with your lecturers but also with your course mates as they will be the ones to help and support you through our assessments and all those things. I'm now doing a PGC in secondary biology at the University of Oxford and the uni helped me uh, with support of my dissertation as it was one of the key points that got me into the uni and also they wrote me glowing references. So I'm Harriet Wardron. I just did a course in Applied Equine Science and Business, um, which was good. <laughs> Super elated, to be honest. Um, it's been a long time. It feels like it's been a long time um, coming, so it's been it's brilliant, yeah. The community here, I really love the size of the university. Um, it's a lot smaller than other places, so it's really great to have that smaller community of friends. Just to have fun and chat to everyone, you know, I think that saying hello and introducing yourself is the best thing to do. Um, so yeah, just to have fun. <laughs> uh, I'm going to go away travelling for a little bit, go and explore the world before settling down, definitely, for sure. Yeah. Hi, I'm Sri. I'm graduated from Very Royal Agriculture point. University and the course is Masters in Sustainable Agriculture and the Food Security. Yeah, it's really awesome and it's like fulfilling my whole dreams and very excited to, to be a part in a new world. Are you? Are you really feels like a home? It's just not like all other universities. It's just like the university is very wel welcoming and the staff is very friendly and we do got some uh, mental support from the university as well so it's really cheering up us and it's really feel like me at home i would like to give uh, don't, uh, like don't hesitate to ask anything like the university and the professors are always welcoming you if any it's you if you have any bad situations you can talk to them and don't take any extreme steps RAU is really practical, practical uni. You can go some field trips, and it's really enjoy. You will enjoy the university. Um, I didn't, I didn't thought much about it, but I would like to to be an entrepreneur, uh, some kind of dairy farms or something. So I would like to open my own food production and some dairy production. My name is Chris Baker, and I studied international business management at the RAU. How do I feel? Um, pleased, it's hard work, especially through COVID, but um, I was quite well supported uh, throughout. So yeah, it was inevitable really. What do I love about the RAU? Uh, the enterprise team uh, and the entrepreneurship teaching is some of the best in the country. So yeah, I feel really well supported and set up now I've left. Do the enterprise program in first and second year, because you, you, you go to uni for your degree, but you can, be, you can launch a multi-million pound business by the time you leave, which is uh, something I'm able to do. So. Yeah, we've just been valued at over a million. So, um, yeah, that's a, result, a direct result of the enterprise program at the RAU. So, um, yeah, I would say start those sorts of things early uh, before your dissertation starts. So my name is Emilia Morozovaita and I've, done, I've just graduated from doing the Applied Equine uh, Science and Business course and I'm really happy about winning it. I've won the Dengue Corps Speed Prize um, and I won a book with it and so I'm very happy of winning it. Um, it was the dis for the dissertation of the best nutrition dissertation of 2023 so yeah. Yeah I feel, I feel really happy and I'm really proud of myself. Uh, I've worked really hard and I've I couldn't be proud of myself. So I really enjoyed studying at the RU because I've heard before I, I started studying, I heard that there's a lot of research happening here, and I've formed really good um, research uh, skills studying here. And I really enjoyed that there's a lot of uh, be business blending blend as well. So that, that really gave me a lot of skills um, in the business part as well. And the uh, the thing that I enjoyed the most was um, doing my internship, um, which I did at lab, that lab to field in France. And it's all thanks to Simon Daniels, one of my lecturers, uh, because he got me the internship um, and I did all my research there and that's why I won the award. 
So next week I'm starting uh, my master's degree at the University of Lincoln and I'm studying uh, microbiology and I'm hopefully continuing to become a research scientist in the field of uh, microbiology. Yes, so my name is Megan Stacey and I've actually studied two courses here. So I did rural land management as my undergraduate degree and I've just, fin well, I've just finished and graduated from my business management master's. Bittersweet really. Um, it's really great because we've put so much hard work in, um, me and my course, that it's great to sort of finally finish it. But it's really sad to be leaving after all this time because it's sort of home now. Um, so yeah, bittersweet. <laughs> the people mainly, the community, um, everyone's quite just friendly and lovely and it, yeah as I say it just feels like home especially after being here for so long um, that's sort of what I love and it's so close-knit and everything on campus is so close together it really just feels like home yeah just be yourself um, I know it can be quite scary to come to a university where you don't know anybody um, but I think be yourself and you can't fail um, I've got a graduate job um, I'm now a I get this mixed up it's a bit wordy a graduate rural surveyor with Carter Jonas in Winchester so I'm studying towards my CAAB exams and my APC in two years. My name is Quincy Tam. Um, I graduated from the Graduate Diploma in Agriculture with Distinction. I, I feel great. I mean, my parents are here, so I, I feel really... Yeah, I mean, I just wanted to make my parents proud and then have a lovely day with them. And I guess, you know, everything's great today. So I love what about the uh, what I love about the RU is it's very intimate. So it's not like huge university where everyone is just a number. So yeah, all the uh, teachers and um, all the staff members have a very person, pers personal approach to us, and I really love that about you know the RU. We call each other by our first names, and I, I really love that about the university. It's very different from my where I did my undergrad undergraduate degree. Study hard <laughs> uh, because there really is. I mean. There are so many things that you can do. I mean, you can sometimes be really easy for you to like lose track of or lose sight of what's really important. And I think that really the knowledge that you get from here and the help that you can get um, from the teachers to help you get there to, to be a knowledgeable person about agriculture is something that's really valuable and something that you can only do here. So I think that that's my advice. I'm right now uh, because I, I have. Prior to doing like the GDI, I have no agricultural background. I'm right now helping in a, a local um, organic farm in Oxford. So um, I really wanted to be a grower in the future, but right now I'm taking the first steps. Uh, yeah, so hoping to get there soon. I won an um, award for significant contributions to university life. I'm very happy, of course, but um, yeah, just really proud of myself. Managed through three years, worked hard, got it done. I would say make sure you really research the course you want to do. Don't be afraid to get in touch with lecturers and um, administration. Just make sure it's really the course you want to do. Yeah.